Guys, um, sorry about what happened with the Fulham thing. Um, I don't really know what I did, to be fair. Um, yeah, sorry about that. But, you know, we can move to different and greater things, and I know it's a bit, I mean, okay, but we're going in with Derby County. Is that stadium not in the game? I thought it was. Um, Alright, so... We haven't got as much money as we did with the Fulham um, things, and we don't really have a bet, uh, that much of a good team, to be fair. Oh, shit. What have I done? Oh. Whoops. Right, I'll, I'll save it after, don't worry. I'll save it after, 100%. Right, so we will take the most amount of money. Surely that should be quite easy for us. Um, yeah. This is definitely a Premier League team, but definitely a championship team, if I've got to say so myself. Um, Louis Sibley, I know he has good potential. And um, Tom Lawrence is just an absolute baller, to be fair. Um, we might need a new striker because that guy, uh, Kazim Richards, he's old and he's slow. Um, actually, you know what? We're going to use Plange. Very weird name, but you know, we move. Yellick, Buchanan. Uh, yeah, we definitely need centre backs. I think both of our centre backs are old. Yeah, 36 and 33. 29. And 29. Okay. It's a very aging squad, but I reckon we can do something with it. Uh, whether that's bringing a couple of loan players. Obviously, you guys should know that I do not like to use the Youth Academy, as it is quite a big cheat. Because you just get it like a 72 rated, and it's just going to be like too easy. By the time you're at top in the championship, they'll be like 87 rated, so... You know, we're not going to be using that guy um, for the foreseeable future. Um, we will renew some young players' contracts that we're definitely going to want to keep. Um, we're going to renew our right-backs contract. Oh, you see, sometimes that happens and... You really cannot do anything with it. Right, four years, lovely. Right, Tom Lawrence, we're gonna we're going to have to keep him. Right, one year, lovely. Alright. Uh Sibley is staying alright. Uh, I can't be asked looking at it anymore. So yeah, we'll we'll just move like that. Um we do unfortunately only have about five million pounds. So we're actually going to have to try and find some loan players, which is going to be quite hard because when you look at like the top leagues, like I don't know Premier League and stuff, you don't really find very many like quality young talents that are coming on loan. So yeah. Is this good? No. Is anyone here like quality? No. Okay. I think I know someone. 
Oh no, he's on loan for a season, isn't he? Um, I don't know anyone then, to be fair. We we could just go like the normal way. Like the way that I normally do it to try and find some good young talents. Right, so we go 21. And then we go just England. And hopefully you find some like quality talents like Jared Branthwaite could be good. He's showing great potential, so that could be good. Trevor Chalaber might be a bit too much though. Charlie Cresswell, I think he's only like uh, 62 rated, but you know we can use him. We can try and get him up to a high um, thing. can try and get him up to a high overall. Oh yeah, I need to put on do not disturb that. Right. Sorry about that boys. Right there we go, do not disturb is now on. Uh MBE so could be decent Ted and Mengi. I know he's on loan. Um we we'll just we'll just keep Ted and Mengi there for now because he is probably just like a quality talent that could be decent for us. Alright, so we've looked through and I mean we found a decent shortlist I'd say. I mean these two are really the ones that I'm looking at. So we will sim about 16 days and I'll see you in a bit. Um, what's his face is way too much. Uh, Chalibur is way too much. Um, so we've got to uh, go in for Jared Branthwaite. Um, he isn't that much but he is a brilliant young prospect. Um, it is quite a big bit into our budget. 2.4 million, that is lovely that. And Jared Branthwaite could be on his way to joining Derby County. I, I reckon this is a very good signing for us. Um, can be an absolute beast in career mode. We'll put him up for 6.6 .6 grand a week. Lovely that. And Jared Brownfoot joins Le Club. Sorry, the amount of flipping. Um, the amount of foot crunch things I said in that will not be repeated for copyright reasons. Alright. So we've got a quality centre back in already. Maybe we need a nice young goalkeeper. And I think I know the man for the job. Evando. Martin van der Volt. I know I definitely said that name wrong, but, you know, we move. Um, we can do a cheeky little swap. So we put in, I don't know, this guy. And an extra 2 million. Plus a 5% sell on clause. Okay. That, that is a very good signing for us. Uh, two signings in a row, actually. Um, I think he's at 72 overall. If he's not, I'm going to be very pissed. Um, sorry for my bad language there. Sorry, Harry, I know that you're watching. Um, I apologise, lad. Okay. Van der Voort joins Le Club, and he's 70 overall. That is lovely, that. Uh, we've practically got him for about 3 million, which is lovely. 
and um, Van der Vaart is now in between the sticks. Okay, all right. So I know we don't really have much money left. So we have. I mean, we've got to go in for. We've got to try and sell some players, right? Surely. Um. We don't really want to sell any that like, big players. We might have to sign him uh, from uh, Crystal Palace, as he is only on loan. But you know, Cousin Richards um, on the thingy on the what's it called on the transfer list. There we go. Um, we'll put our El Capitan on. Oh, he's not. He's not a lot. He is not a lot. We might have to try and find someone that's maybe a bit younger. Um, yeah, we might have to loan someone in to fill that spot for our El Capitan leaving. All right, we've we've sold a crappy player. Uh, Cousin Richards will be leaving the club for about 500k, which is nice, I guess. It's all right. Messi earns about Messi earns that in about a week, so you know it's not a lot. All right, plunge. Okay, right. I'm going to try and find a centre back that we can loan in. Maybe we can loan in someone that was on our shortlist. No one's on our shortlist anymore. Um, Creswell was on there. I mean, is he really that good? Do we really want Creswell? Um, um, be a NBA saw he, he could be decent approach to loan oh get in that is mint that is peg lovely that right we can loan to buy okay I'm happy with the wages being that okay that's lovely right nice nice Made me happy, made me smile. Nice. Okay. Um, we're going to say him a bit to see what he does say. To see if he wants to. Oh, God's sake. Oh, mad. You're ruining it. Look at my lips. You're ruining it. Alright. Um, we'll go to 30th. And... Uh, yeah, I guess we can just. All right, we've sold Davis. Um, we're not selling Bielek. Bielek, these next. Hey, got him. Okay. Uh, Saw so will be able to come into our club. Hey, yo, what can he do now? All right. Um. Oh. Oh, I'm still recording. Okay. I thought that I stopped recording for some reason. Um, yeah, we're going to go in for like maybe so. So, yeah. So, we have, in fact, signed MBE so. Um, sorry if you heard a cheeky little voice crack there. We all love a cheeky voice crack. <laughs> so, this is... The team we have got, it's very good, very nice, very good, very nice, um, but we just need to sign that striker permanently, um,
Um, Tom Lawrence. I don't know if we do accept this. You know what? He's staying. He's our El Capitano. He's staying. Um, so we've got Huddersfield Town next. And um, that is the team we are lining up with. Our, d our defensive midfielders, um, unfortunately, do have lack of form on... Um, which isn't very nice. But let's just head into this game against Huddersfield. And, um, yeah. Okay, let's go. Here we go. Derby County against Huddersfield Town. We're hoping this one's a good game. With um, the amount of signings we have made. Tom Lawrence making an interception there from Etting. Pippa, Sober Thomas, he could be a very good signing if we do sign him, but I don't really know if we have the facilities for that. Pippa, oh it's Sober Thomas again, Yellick, great tackle. Sober Thomas, back to Etting. Well, in Tom Lawrence, we haven't had much of the ball, to be fair. Pippa. Great tackle. Now, Bielik. Good ball over the top. I'm lucky that Plange can't get there. I think, or is it just Plang? I don't know how to say his name. I'm sorry, boys. If you guys know in the um, know how to say it, then tell me in the comments, please. Great stop from Vandervoort. No, it's out to Bird. Surely he's got a fit Bird. O'Brien, O'Brien, sorry. I don't know why I said O'Brien. Plange, come on, lad. Oh, he's through. It's Plange. It's Plange. The Crystal Palace Loney has scored the first goal for Derby County. And it's Plange to smack it home. What a goal. Lovely that. What a finish. From the Crystal Palace Loney. That is absolutely lovely, if I do say so myself. We all love a bit of that, don't we? Now it's Ward. We do love a cheeky little go-ahead goal. Great tackle from Saw on his debut. Now it's Tom Lawrence getting absolutely clattered by Pearson there. Now Bird. Good pass through. It's Plange again. It's Plange again! What to say from Blackman? That might sound racist, but it's not. That's his name. Okay. Plange going for a volley there. Unfortunately, it didn't pan out. Unlucky from Bird there. Now it's Tom Lawrence. Takes a shot. Great stop from Blackman to keep it into his firm grasp great tackle from Lawrence to win the ball back now it's Louis Sibley great pass out wide to Brian Brian great pass into middle to Bird now it's Bird into middle Brian almost scoring great inception inside the box from Pearson I believe it was Blackman boots it out as there was very heavy pressure. Now, great. Oh, Plange. Oh, that would have been a lovely goal. He flicks it over um, a player. And he's gone for a half volley there. Un and unfortunately, it didn't pan out. Great pass out to Bielik. 
Oh, to bird. Bird! Oh, my word! That is lovely! What a shot from Max Bird! And it flies into the top corner. What a goal, son. What a goal. Take a bow. Blowing it. What a finish. Now it's O'Brien. As they play from kickoff now. After an absolutely brilliant finish from Max Bird. Now it's Pippa. Derby. Haven't really had much of the ball, but they've made the work ethic. Unlucky there from Laurent. Very unlucky not to finish that one. Great stop from Blackman though. Terrible crossing from Tom Lawrence, but you know, it's it's fine, it's fine, you know. People make mistakes. Etting. Sober Thomas, great tackle from Lawrence. Oh it falls out to Knight. Knight he goes for a shot. And it is half time now. Great game from Derby County, brilliant performance, uh, Tom Lawrence putting in a brilliant shift, Max Bird with a lovely finish into the top right, top left corner sorry, and uh, playing just absolutely quality. Now it's Louis Sibley playing from kickoff. Louis Sibley, he's run through them. Playing, Joey shot and he scored another one. It's lovely. It is lovely football. And I've, I sincerely have to check if we have sliders on. Yes, we do. I apologise for that, boys. Um, but those, I mean, I'm still counting it. Three goals. And it's, it's the second goal for playing. As... We are playing absolutely brilliantly against Huddersfield Town. Now Chicken Tikka Karma. Or Chicken Karma, sorry. I don't know why I said Chicken Tikka Karma. Now here's Tom Lawrence. Playing through play, enjoys offside. Offside by a minuscule margin. Let's see what I did there. Pippa. No, it's Ward. Great tackle from Saw. Brilliant, that. Now Tom Lawrence. Oh. Unlucky there. Now it's Blackman. Smacks it out. Bird wins the header. Only to head it to Pippa. Great tackle from Bird. Absolutely brilliant performance from him today. And Bielik lose it, loses it to Pippa. Now it's Ward. Great tackle from Buchanan. Buchanan wins the ball back but loses it to Etting who plays a lovely ball to Chicken Corma. Bielik. Lovely that. Lovely skills. But we lose possession again. Now it's Ward. Great tackle from Saw. Lovely. And now it's Buchanan. Back on the ball to Lawrence. Now it's Tom Lawrence. Shrugged off the ball, really, there. Great, great interception from Bird. Now it's Knight. Good pass into the middle. Now it's Plange. If he gets past his marker, Sober Thomas intercepts. Now it's Ward. Great tackle from Buchanan. Loses it though. Now it's O'Brien. Great game this for people at home. Now it's so. Saw driving. Oh, loses it there. Surely that was offside. 
great uh, stop from Van der Voort though. Now it's Brian. Runs down the wing with absolutely beaming pace. Finds a back post cross. No one's there. Etting. Oh, Brian. Please. Toffolo. Great tackle from Bird. Now it's Bielik. Referee. Okay, I'll take a I'll take a cheeky little free kick. And now it's Jared Bramford. We haven't really seen him on the ball that much. But he comes out. Very clunky on the ball, can I just say. But he gets past a man. Crosses it into the middle. Louis Sibley! Unlucky. Brilliant there from Jared Bramford to play with um, Pearson. Who eventually did tackle him quite hard. But, you know. Louis Sibley, unfortunately, missed uh, the bicycle kick opportunity. And it's brilliant from Jared Bramford. Oh, there we go. Didn't know that the whistle had blown for full time. But lovely that. Um, great game. Can I just say, what an absolute peacher from Max Bird here. Takes a shot, no chance. Black man was saving that. But Plains just had absolute quality today. Two goals. But, I mean, Plange could have had another there. And this would have been an absolute goal of the season contender if that would have flown in. But, unfortunately, Jamal Blackman did save it. But Plange did get himself man of the match, which you actually cannot complain about. Um... It's a very great, uh, a very good game that one. And we're looking to learn out Liam Thompson. All right, um, loan agreement. They're taking him on loan for a year. Now it's Preston in the EFL Cup. You know what? We're just going to use the main team. Oh, we've lost to Preston. Oh, well, it's just a Carabao Cup, so it doesn't really matter. I'm hoping that we do get a cheeky little run in the FA Cup, though. All right, our defence is absolutely knackered. We'll put... Um, that's, that's... All right, we'll put Stearman in the... All right, boys, um... Before we go into our next game, I have just got to say thank you all for watching. Please drop a like and subscribe if you are new to the channel. And goal of the season. Uh, why did I say goal of the season? Um, player of the episode goes to Luke Plange, a Crystal Palace loanee. Got himself two goals and almost scored an absolute peacher as he flicked it over. His uh, competitor and unfortunately Jamal Blackman saved it. Uh, thank you all for watching and peace out.